In this video, we will show you how to select the correct V-Green retrofit replacement motor for your pool application. Before installing, using, or servicing this product, carefully read and fully understand instructions, including all warnings, cautions, and safety notice statements in your V-Green motor user manual. As always, be sure to use personal protective equipment. Congratulations, you've decided to upgrade your existing single speed pump motor to variable speed with an energy efficient V-Green motor. V-Green motors are available in multiple horsepower, voltage, and flange configurations, covering a wide range of pull pump motor applications. Let's walk through the steps to determine the correct V-Green motor for the job. First, refer to the motor nameplate located on the side of the motor. Next, take note of the horsepower and service factor. Service factor multiplied by horsepower equals total horsepower. Total horsepower is the maximum load the motor is capable of carrying. Now we need to determine incoming voltage. This can be accomplished in one of two ways. Measure incoming voltage with a multimeter by applying test leads to the mains connections at the motor. Make sure to refer to your multimeter user manual for proper operation instructions. Or you could compare existing motor connections to the wiring diagram on the original motor nameplate. The configuration of the wires will match the 115 or 230 volt wiring diagram on the motor. Then identify the flange type as either square flange, C-face, or through bolt. Finally, refer to the V-Green Motor Quick Cross-Reference Card matching the total horsepower, voltage, and flange type from the original motor to the corresponding V-Green Motor on the card. Check out other how-to videos in the Century Electric Motors YouTube channel. Visit pool-motors.com to learn more about V-Green Variable Speed Motors.